smoking the deer in the back box, seeing the ducks flying, casting the fly to the trout houses, hearing the ducks closing. Troop. We out here up to KC up our lot. Just doing a bit of fishing. Doing a bit of fishing. Um, we've been doing pretty good. We've been doing pretty good. Look down here. A few snapper in the boat, especially this big puppy down here. A couple of biggies. Got a couple of um, a couple of terrors in there. It's been a bit of a slow battle for me. The old. Um, Wifey's been slamming them on the Tika Magma. She's been just outfishing, outfishing, um, outfishing us today. She's running the old, um, what are you running here, baby? So she's running a Torium, Torium um, 30 on the old green Incredible Hulk grill on the Tika Magma. And she's been peeling them in today. Peeling them in. And we're running here. We're running the old um, Shimano Shadow X with the Shimano Speedmaster series. Two speed. Wicked ass. Out here fishing. So the wife has been catching um, quantity. She's been catching quantity. But I want to show you something. I might be catching less. But... We've been catching quality, quality here. Oh. So yeah, that's us. We out here, cruising up the coast. Saved us a few. We're just further out this other way uh, earlier. But we run up, running a bit low on bait. Running a bit low on bait. We move spots and we're slamming all the snapper right over here our spot we are now but we are out of bait so we're just cutting up a bit of cod we caught a bit of cod today so we're just using that for a bit of bait sweet Torium's winning on numbers but the Shadow X is winning on quality sure. sweet take two with our homemade fish flipper so put them on there like so make sure you clear your line you don't want the little bugger, hook them up onto the hook, just like, just like the ones in store, and then flick them out. Kia ora, CJ Arnold, just heading out for a bit of a spearfish. Me and Mumsy have been out here um, catching some fish, but we ran out of bait, so we had to use the old vino because a little stoke got into it. However, we're just going to jump in the water, go um, spearfish us some bait, hopefully slay us a few marmals. But before I jump in, I just want to show you the gear that I'm using. Uh, just show you quickly what we got. is the Marty's Free Mask. Um, real nice low volume mask. Primo is for free diving. Why I like this, this mask here has got, um, it's not as soft, the silicone is not as soft as your, um, as other silicone masks. Uh, so the reason I like this is that I can still jump in the water with a little bit of hoodoo hoodoos around my face and it's not going to leak. Not going to leak. So um, that's why I prefer this mask. And it's also a comfy fit for the size. Primo, Primo S. So this is the, the mask um, that I choose um, out of all the masks that I've had or all the masks that I wear. This is my favorite, favorite one. For that reason that I don't need to have, don't need to be clean shaven to, um, to chuck this mask on so I won't leak. Uh, the other thing I use is... Um, Marty's Element Snorkel. The reason I like this snorkel is that it's a nice flexi snorkel. Um, primo air, so if you're going through seaweed, it actually doesn't get caught up and whoop your mask with your face. Uh, so it actually bends. So $20. Come in, 20 bucks. score you uh, just a ball, plain big ball snorkel. Wicked as flexi airs. Uh, one more thing I'd like to show you. The old weapon of choice. So the weapon of choice. We use the, um, well, we're going to spear our, our bait fish and our marmals today. Uh, it's a little bit of overkill, but um, what I use is the Marty's Viper Pro 1200. So runty airs, 
Granty is a spear gun, comes double rubbered, so plenty, plenty grunts if you're going to go out and slay some um, kingies. Um, comes with a nice um, high tensile spear, so wicked ass spear, good flexy spear. So if you do hit a rock, it's not going to buckle out of shape. Um, the other thing I like about this gun is that all its components in the trigger is all stainless, stainless uh, mechanism. So less corrosion, less rust, uh, wicked ass, wicked ass trigger system. The other reason, one of the main reasons why I like this gun um, is that it's probably one of the only spear guns that's built with a V-grip uh, pistol grip. So what I mean by V-grip in here, it sits perfect, perfect in your hand. So your everything there just fits naturally, like you're actually holding a, a proper, proper pistol. So it's got a real nice, comfy grip. It's easy to hold on to. So when you're reaching out, it actually sits perfectly or sits balanced in your hand. Um, where some some grips they quite wide to hold on to whereas this one here is a uh, primo as fits last uh, but now nah, this is what we're using so the Marty is Viper 1200 uh, this is probably one of our favorite um, kingy guns this year enough grunt to slam anything really uh, but that's us so that's the gear that I'm fitted with and yeah this is the gear I love too good just cruising out of the sun